What's going on everyone? I'm Scribble. Uh, this is my modded Minecraft server. It's Infinity Evolved. Plus we have the Morph mod from Direwolf. Uh, what I plan on doing with this, I guess, series or whatever, is a bunch of how-to Minecraft. Uh, where I just show you basic things on how to do things. Because uh, what I found out is that we just bought this server like a, about a week ago. And we, we've been playing non-stop. Uh, so we're actually pretty far and But I figured well, why not show you guys how to do things? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how I build my house And what I don't know the exact numbers of all the materials you need. I uh, just kind of play it by ear uh, but I build this for every single server I have So as you can see we are actually very far for only having this for a week but you can use whatever materials you want. I'm going to use oak. Uh, I'm going to use oak, wood, birch wood planks, um, cobblestone stairs, and um, stone brick. So let's see. Oak. I don't know how many. I don't, like I said, I don't know how many you need. Oops. I'll just take all of it, I guess. I might actually need more, honestly. Um, and then I need stone. Stairs. Got all the oak wood. Let's see what else do I need? Doors. Some of these. This is just um, clear glass. I made it in a smelter. Uh, what else? Stone birch. Need a ton of birch. Uh, that should be enough to get us started. All right. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna go in intervals of five. So you're gonna start wherever you want. The front of your house. Like I think I want mine. I think I want mine facing this way this time. So the front of my house, I'm gonna go one. So you want five spaces in between. So you want to put one on the sixth. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And same. Now you're gonna go horizontal. A user has joined the support channel. That's kind of in the way. Yeah, all right. So one, two, and one, two. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Go. Three, four, five. Yep. Two, three, four, five. Yep, okay. So now that we got that done, now we're gonna go this way uh, four sets of five. So one, two, three, four, five on the sixth. One, two, three, four, five. On the sixth. One, two, three, four, five. Sixth. One, two, three, four. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, five, six. Like that. And then you're going to come in. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then another one here. All right. Let me fly up real quick. So now, you should, it should look like this. What is that? Three, six, nine, ten. It's 12 blocks. Five spaces apart, all the way around. Let me get rid of this just so it doesn't confuse anyone. Alright. Holy moly, there's a bunch of zombies. Okay. 
So now, what are you going to do? You're going to go up for a total of four on each column. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. All right, so now that we have that done, now you're gonna trace it. You're gonna leave this section right here, whatever your front is, you're gonna leave that open. So you're not gonna connect it like this, you'll connect it this way. That. Oops. Then you'll connect it all the way around. So after you do that, you'll trace it all the way around. All right. So now that you have the outline done. Now, all the way around, you're going to go up four more, except for this one. You're going to leave this one like it is. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right. Now that's like that. You're going to connect everything again. I need to go get more blocks. I hmm. wonder where all my blocks are. Do I have it somewhere else? Oh, here they are. They're in my inventory. Okay, so now you have that shape. So you have like a upside down U or an N I guess and then you have a sideways L. That's your second floor there. And then now what you're gonna do is just this square right here. You're gonna go up four more. Then you're gonna connect them as well. So it should look like this. You're not going to connect this one or this one on the inside. Nothing on the inside because it's just a waste of wood at that point. So now we're going to go up one more and then that'll be our top tower right there. We are in survival mode, so that's why it's taking so long. And I'm flying because we have the morph mod. It's it's from Direwolf, where we can morph into whatever we kill. Okay, so now that that's done, you're going to take your uh, stone bricks, or whatever material you're using, and for the bottom layer, you're going to just outline everything. Uh, this one here is going to be your door. And this one here. So that back left one. And then the front middle is going to be your doorway. So how I do it. Get away from me, zombie. You too. There we go, just like that. Then now you have a doorway plus a window. Then with this one over here, oops, you're gonna fill all of it in except for this last one. Like that. So 
it should look like that. Now for everything else, what you're gonna do? Just gonna put an outline all the way around the window like this, all the way around. There you go, just like that. Now what you're going to do is you will do your, well I guess you can do this at any point. But now for the floors. But that's not where I want that to be. Why is it? I don't know why it's doing that. I'm hitting it in the right spot. Maybe because I'm flying around or something, I don't know. I always put it underneath here. Just so when I'm doing my wiring and stuff, I know where the house begins because it's surrounded by wood. Need to eat some food pretty soon. Oh no! Man! I think we have all this dirt on us. that fix this okay now we're just gonna oh forget about this now we're just gonna lay our floors down All right, so now we have a floor. What I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna put a couple of doors in. Just so we can be protected from those creepers. I don't come in and blow anything up anymore. There we go. Alright, so now... Oh, they blew this up too? Everything else look good? Your house should be looking like this right about now. Now what we're gonna do... Is right here in the corner... You're going to go two blocks in like this, just above the door. And then right here, now's where you start your next one. 
we can do is like this little L pattern here. So you're gonna you're gonna come out three blocks from this plus sign. The, the back door's here, so you're gonna come out three blocks. Then then you're gonna go in four blocks. One, two, three, or I guess three more blocks. So a total of four blocks. So like that. Then you'll go out one and then connect it. So you have this like weird zigzag. And I'll show you why we do that here in a minute. But now what you're gonna do, you're gonna fill in the second floor. Like I said, you need a lot of wood. If you're doing it out of birch, or if you're doing it out of any wood like I'm doing, it's a lot of wood. Okay, there's our second floor. Oh, no it's not. We need to do the stairs. So you're going to need eight stairs. Do I have any more birch? Uh, not much. It'll work though. So here's why we had this weird shape right here. So here, you're going to put in your staircase. We do it here because it matches up perfectly. Ta-da! So you can walk down it without a problem. Now I have a staircase up to the second floor. But now what you need... Now what we're going to... Oh, we're gonna, I need to show you the second... Need to get some food. I think I got fish in one of these chests somewhere. So you should look like this now. Got our second floor done. Now we're going to move on to the walls on the second floor. So once again, you're going to do the you're going to do that pattern effect, except for this one will be the doorway. And we have our doorway with a little window. And then, yeah, I'll show you the interior here in a minute, uh, where to put blocks. Alright, that's done there. Does it look like this? Now once again, we're going to be putting in the flooring. Oops. Alright, so now we're going to continue the pattern all the way to the top. It'd just be this room here, just like that. And then for here, what you're going to do is you'll make two doorways. with the doorway in the middle. Oh, I'm throwing blocks all over the place. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I forgot. You need to have this one here open. So yeah, next to the next to this doorway, that'll be open. The same with here. Oops. One thing I was trying to show is the one thing I messed up. Just like that. There we go. So it should look like this at this point. Now we'll go up to go up a layer. Need more birch. Yeah, I need birch. Probably just a stack will do. Probably not even that much, honestly. Alright, so now we're on that top floor. Once again, we will just do a standard pattern all the way around. You don't have to do yours exactly like mine. I actually learned this from years ago. I don't remember I don't remember where I learned it from. But there's some video I watched. I've been making it ever since. Okay. Now what I like to do personally here it is. Of course, you're going to fill in the roof. What I like to do is I like to leave the one right in the middle open. For multiple reasons. One, so I can get up here. Especially if you're, if you're in like vanilla or something and you're not... Uh, you can't fly, so it makes it easier. You just build up through there. So this is how your house should look right now. What you could do is you could make this level right here out of stone, just so it kind of mixes it up a little bit. But now what you need to do is this is just going to be blank space. So put whatever whatever block you want up here. If you have dirt, put dirt up here, it's not going to be seen. What this is doing is it, it's going to prevent mobs from spawning. We're just going to make a pyramid here. Yeah, like I said, it doesn't matter what block you use. And then... You're going to do the same for here, kind of. This is just going to make it easier for her to put stairs up here. You don't have to do this. I just do it because it's easier. We're actually going to be removing these, so it doesn't matter. Put down a block that's easy to gather. So there's that. It'll look like that at this point. Now for the fun part. You need stairs, 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 stairs. Lots and lots of stairs. So what we're going to do, coming down to this side, you're going to start right here. The second plus sign. Once you get to this back side here, and stop right there.
And now all you gotta do is just fill everything in. You can use whatever uh, stair you want. Stair block. I do this because it was so long ago when I learned it. You can only make either this or you can make cobblestone stairs or you can make um, stone, like stone brick stairs. That's how long ago. <laughs> That's how long ago it was. Uh, so yeah, you can use whatever you want to make stairs. I just do it because it. I use it because it makes a con. It puts contrast on the house. Oh, here. Here. There you go. Just like that. Now what you're gonna need, you're gonna need um, st cobblestone slabs. Don't need this, this, this. All this is gone. Don't need any of this. That. Don't need any of this. Uh, don't blow up, don't blow up. Okay. Blow up my whole ME system. Oh, that would suck. Lab. I think you only need like two of them, or no, you need three. Uh, when you do the, when you take your cobblestone like that, you need three sets. So I think nine is what it is. So what you can do, you're just gonna place it right here like this. Give it a little cap. There we go. So now, uh, two things are going to happen. You have stairs and half slabs, so now mobs won't spawn up here. Spiders will climb up it, which that's kind of a pain. So now, what we need... Oh, we needed that. Uh-oh. Alright, you're going to be a problem. Stop it. So many mobs, stop, go away. Did I do... Uh, no, I didn't. Okay. So now, we're going to do the interior stuff. So you need nine ladders. Which I already have here. Uh, you're going to need some kind of window. So whatever you want to make windows with. Uh, and then you need some... Oak... How much that in head? And then you're also going to need a gate and some fencing. So what I'm going to do, we'll go back to the inside here. Oh, it's probably, I probably should have got torches too. I'm going to grab those. I have a thousand torches, jeez, man. Alright, so what we, we're starting on the second floor. And what we're going to do, this is going to be our bedroom. Let me go back to human. There we go, just like that. You're gonna go nine up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like that, there we go. While I'm up here, I might as well put glass up here. Glass and torches. Oh, the reason I left that open up here is because I usually put glowstone right here. Just to help brighten it. And we'll do torches. And here's where we need to take all this stuff out. Right here. And for now, you can put torches in here for now, just like this. 
corners. But I'm going to put glowstone right here in this little slot. So I'm not really too worried about it. Like I said, need a need a block that's easily can easily take like I'm doing here. And again, you can light this up. I'm going to use glowstone. I need a couple of doors. So, where's my glass? Don't want the wood, so I just need this. Put our glass windows in here. That'll be lit up. I need some doors. Again, you're going to just put all your glass all the way around. Your house like this. Make sure you get the bedroom. The door for here as well. Okay, so while we're here, take some of your fencing. I'm gonna put a border here. All the way around the outside. Like that. Again, you need a door. And then I'm gonna put my torches, I just put them in the corners. They're out of the way and it keeps everything symmetrical. I put them all on this top bar here. That. Put one here, one here. You can put it however you want on the building. I just put them like this. You'll have one light area right here in the middle. It's kind of annoying, but you can put whatever you want there if you want to do something. Make it look better. Put glass up here, right? Oh, and then uh, you're going to take some more of your fencing. You're going to border this right here. There you go. So now you won't fall down here like I did earlier. For your house. There's all that. This is done. So let me get the torches in here. There. There. Good, just like that. Then we will do the front fence here, 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 and here at our gate. Like that. Need to add all the doors. Hope I got enough doors. I don't even know if I do or not. We got the two front ones. Then we got the bedroom door. Got this door. That door. And this door. There we go. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna grab some glowstone while I'm here. Stop it. Ooh, I don't have much glowstone. I need to go get some more. We'll start with this one up here. That up there. Oh, one short. Alright. This is done, this is done. Oh, I need to close these doors. And this one done. Yep. 
All right. And you can do the inside of your house however you want to do it. All closed. So now you have your house. So what I do, this is just a standard house like that. But what I do is, it, again, to keep everything symmetrical. I go around and I put torches right here on the outside. This also lights up a little bit behind, around the house. That way you don't get a bunch of mobs like right outside your door. Like that. And then I always do this oop, triple one here. That's just me. Make sure you get these up on top. There we go. That is our house. And you can decorate however you want. Bed. Here in the bedroom. We sleep. There we go. I can see the house in the daytime. There we go. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, make sure you subscribe because I'm going to be doing a lot more how-to Minecraft. It'd be really basic stuff. Uh, this is I built this house like this just for if you want to do it in vanilla. But what I'm actually going to be end up doing is I'm going to tear out this wall, this wall, and part of this wall for different things. Uh, make sure you guys follow because you guys will will see what I'm going to build with all this stuff. Or how, what I'm going to be putting in there. Um, and then also, we're going to have like a fishing shack and all that kind of stuff. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to show you guys how everything works and how you do things. So if you have any questions, leave a comment below. And I will see you next time.